If you're new to the iPhone or you just wanted to start sending messages through iMessage, you first need to enable it and sign in. I'll show you how to do it. Now, the first thing you're going to do is open up the settings app of your iPhone. Now, in the settings app, you'll see at the very top is my name. If you see your name, just tap on it. And if you see the option to sign in, you first need to sign in to your Apple ID account. So if you don't already have one, it will prompt you to create a new Apple ID account. This is the account that manages your iCloud, your iMessages, your Apple accounts, all your personal information, all of that. So set up an account or just sign in if you already have one. After we've done that, let's go back out of here and we need to get to the settings for your messages. So scroll down to the very bottom and tap on apps. Once you've done that, we're going to scroll down to the very bottom again, and you'll be able to see we're going to go to messages here and tap on that. Once you're in here, you might see a screen that looks like this, or you might see a screen that looks like this. You can see it says here messages, and it has maybe your email address here, and it has the sign in option or create a new account. So if you see a screen that looks like this, just tap on the sign in button. However, if you see a screen that looks like this, you want to make sure iMessage is toggled on. If it is turned off, all you need to do is toggle it on. Now, keep in mind, after you've turned on iMessage, you can send and receive text messages through iMessage through your phone number or an email address as well. So on here, it says you can receive iMessages and to and reply from. I just have my phone number checked here. However, you can also check an email address if you wanted to be able to send and receive basically those texts through iMessage through your phone number or email address. Now, after you've done everything, it should be up and running. You should be able to open up the messages app here. And then from there, basically, you can just hop into a conversation. You can see this is just a text with myself. You can just send a sample text to your own phone number and hit hi and send. And it should have the blue text message bubble indicating that iMessage is up and running and you're good to go.